For more videos, visit ForTheSakeOfEducation.com Alright guys, let's do this problem that says determine the distance A as a fraction of the beam's length for locating the roller support so that the moment in the beam B is zero. At B, of course. So, the first thing we're going to do is just um, draw a couple of forces. As you can see, there's a force here AY that is only vertical. And of course, C is anchored, so C would have a vertical and possibly a horizontal reaction. So, the first thing we're going to do is find AY. So to find the y, we're going to assume that clockwise is positive for the sum of the moments at C. And it is equal to 0 because it's statics. So what we get is minus P times L because the moment created by this P right here is P times the whole length of the assembly plus AY times L minus A because from C to a there's a distance of l minus this distance a minus p times l over 3 because that's the moment created by this second p right here and it is a distance of l over 3 from c and the sum of all of this is equal to 0 so when you solve for a y you get that a y is equal to P times L plus P times L over 3 all over L minus A. So if you could further uh, simplify this, eventually you're going to reach that AY is equal to 4 PL over 3 times L minus A. So that's as simple as this gets. Now what I'm going to do is we have to analyze the internal forces at B right here. So I'm going to pick this section from B going to the left and I'm going to draw it right here. So this is B. This is the moment. And this is the share this is actually P so all they're asking us is the moment they're not really asking us about the share or the normal so we're not gonna draw it this is P this is this P right here there is an a y right here and there is a P right here this is P also <clears throat> so now we know that going clockwise some of the moments at B is equal to zero. So you know that AY times 2 over 3 L minus A, that's the distance from here, from B to A, is 2 thirds of L minus the distance A. So that's the moment created by AY. Minus P times 2 over 3 L is equal to zero. So what, you, what you're going to do is you're going to replace a y by this that we found right here. Like this, 4 pl all over 3 times l minus a times 2 thirds l minus a minus p 2 over 3 l is equal to zero. So let me turn the page. So when you further simplify that equation that I just wrote, you're going to get it to look something like this. 2 over 3 PL is equal to 2 over 3. At the top, we got PL times 4 thirds L minus A. And this is L minus A. So as you can see, you can cancel the 2 over 3 the P, the L, the P, the L, and eventually you get, on the, on the left you get 1, and on the right you get this fraction, so it eventually becomes L minus A is equal to 4 over 3 L minus 2A. Sorry, there's a 2 right here. I skipped it. 
and when you solve for a you get that a is equal to 1 over 3 L and that is the final answer please comment below if you want me to do any problems and I'll be happy to help thank you